Hello, I'm Herald Press editor Megan Grevy. Here's a look at the Sunday, January 5th edition of the Herald Press. Uh, in our lead story, Lucas Bechtel looks at some proposed changes to the Indiana Criminal Code that some uh, Indiana prosecutors are um, still want to see some changes to. The, um, the proposed change comes from House Bill 1000, 10, 1006. Um, it changes the felony levels from four to six felony classification, and it reduces the sentence for drug offenders, um, but also um, changes some things where certain offenders would have to serve uh, at least 75% of their sentence instead of 50%. So, um, kind of an interesting story there. Uh, for our centerpiece, we take a look at the first baby born in Huntington County in 2014. His name is Talon Smith, and he is the son of Shanda Spacey and Jeremy Smith from North Manchester. He was born on the 1st at, I believe, around 1 o'clock. So he is our, uh, our New Year baby. Um, we also take a look at Rob Miller, who is the youth sports director at the YMCA. He will be running for a county commissioner. Um, he and Leon Hurlbert will be on the um, Republican primary ticket on May 6th. Also in Sunday's paper, um, kind of a back to school thing, um, the Huntington County Boys and Girls Club had a football day on Friday where kids could play flag football and kind of celebrate the playoffs by wearing jerseys of their favorite teams. Um, it's kind of a way to do a few fun things before the kids had to, had to go back to school. So there's that. Um, our A3 page is milestones tomorrow. And then in sports, the Huntington North Vikings came in fourth in the Weston Close Memorial Wrestling, Wrestling Classic. And um, also the Huntington University women's team beat Taylor 59-43. to uh, That team will play number three Indiana Wesleyan University Wednesday at 7 p.m. So definitely be, out, I'll be on the lookout for that as well. Um, that's, that's what's in the January 5th edition of the Herald Press. Um, just a reminder, it's supposed to get pretty bad out tonight, so make sure you're ready to go for the very cold and very, very wintry temperatures and conditions we're supposed to have. Uh, be safe, and if you do not have to drive in it, please don't. From all of us here at the Herald Press, be safe, have a wonderful day, and we will see you later.